Hey everyone, my name is Tanner Brubaker, and today we'll be talking about water scarcity and how information technologies can be used to solve this problem. To start things off, I think it's important to clearly define water scarcity. Water scarcity is defined as a lack of sufficient water resources to meet the demands of water usage within a region. Water scarcity has been and will continue to be a major issue around the globe. In highly developed countries such as the United States, we typically don't see the harsh effects of water scarcity because of our sturdy infrastructure, which allows us to have an abundance of clean water. There are some examples of mishaps such as the Flint water crisis, but for the most part, the United States as a whole has access to clean and usable water. But in the underdeveloped parts of the world which suffer from pollution and droughts, the fight for water is reality. The use of the issue of water scarcity affects the entire population on Earth. Some people experience strong effects, while some people barely feel it. Even though some people will have clean and running water, they will experience an indirect effect because food prices will rise. And some people will be greatly impacted by this, and finding clean water will be a life or death situation. In the prompt for this assignment, it asks about the different positions people will have on this issue and what their reasonings are. It appears that there aren't any positions, but just those who feel the impacts more than others. For the most part in the United States, we don't think about this topic all the time because we have the luxury of having an abundance of clean water. But someone in an underdeveloped country with limited water would have this issue on their mind on a more consistent basis. With the issue of water scarcity, there isn't a group of people who are for or against it. It's a fact that water scarcity is a global issue in 2018, and it's up to everyone to fix it. There are several different tactics being used to combat this issue of water scarcity. In the places that have access to water, alternatives such as desalinization are being used in order to create safe and usable water. But in places that are prone to droughts, the issue is transporting water. In highly developed countries, water transportation is a fairly easy task. But in the third world countries, transporting water is a major struggle. When it comes to water scarcity, it's safe to say that we have the appropriate technology and ideas in order to solve the, solve the problem. The major issues lie in the government systems that lack the execution needed in order to solve, solve the problem. In the United States, the solutions to these problems take time because of how slow the bureaucracy, bureaucracy is. But in underdeveloped countries, they typically lack government strength and power that would allow them to effectively implement systems and technology that end water scarcity. The information and technology is out there. The issue lies in the implementation of it. That's all I have. Thank you for your time. The references will be posted in the description of the video. Thanks.